Today we're going to cover how to install a panel spacer on your Shantari Carbon. In this example we're going to use one of my 7.5 millimeter spacers with heat set knurled inserts. These inserts require a soldering iron to install and are available inexpensively in kits on Amazon. In this case I'm using an M3 that's 3 millimeters long for the example. When installing these inserts it's important to use a tip like the one I've shown here. From the back of the part, you want to push it as far forward as you can without going through the other side. Now that you have all your heat set inserts installed, it's time to install the panel onto the spacer. The first screws to populate are going to be the ones parallel to the Centauri Carbon logo in the center of the panel in the front and the back. Since many people are probably installing hinges as part of this spacer installation, it is important to leave some spaces open for those hinges. And you should populate the front edge of the panel, the center back edge of the panel, but leave the top and back edges and bottom edges of the panel open for the hinges, as you can see that I've done here. Once you have the screws installed, flip the panel over and verify that no screws are protruding from the edge of the spacer where it meets the chassis. Also, you can enhance the rigidity of the spacer by gluing or melting the parts together. Installing hinges is beyond the scope of this video. Here's a mock-up to give you an idea of what that looks like. That concludes this quick tutorial. Stay tuned for how to install hinges in our next installation. Thanks for watching.